Sorry, yes, Mike. Um, I just wanted to point out that, in my opinion anyway, littered with skyhooks, that if you look at any rational and apparently logical arg argument as, say, a chain of cause and effect, that eventually you arrive somewhere beyond which you can't know anymore. So, for example, you go far back enough in time, you get closer and closer, apparently, to the Big Bang. We may narrow that gap, but there is always a gap. So we've got a chain of logic, which, at the ends, seems to be supported by skyhooks. I think Kant made a much better, better argument than I can. But, so, for example, if our theory is about um, light, or right, we can't know what goes on inside a black hole, etc. So our theories always end somewhere beyond which there is still stuff we don't know. Yeah. Well, thank you. I mean, that's an interesting point. I think it's a wrong one. I think what you're doing is confusing a gap in our knowledge, and of course science has many gaps in, our, in, in, in its knowledge, confusing a gap in our knowledge with a skyhook. A gap in our knowledge is just a challenge. This is something that we're working towards understanding, working towards filling the gap. So, I mean, there are plenty of gaps. You don't even need to go to the profundities of modern physics. Uh, there's a gap at the origin of life. Nobody knows how life began uh, on this planet. Uh, we know once life had begun, we understand pretty well what happened after that. We don't know what the first step was. It's a, it's a mystery of, of chemistry. But we're not filling it with a sky hook. What we're doing is filling it with a kind of temporary waiting until we've found the answer, which is a, a very different matter. A skyhook is not just saying, well, pending future research, we're just going to have to leave that bit not filled in. A skyhook is saying, we are filling it here and now with a fairy, with a god, with an angel, with a unicorn, with, with something that we're positively postulating, which superficially appears to explain something, but actually doesn't. In the, the gaps in scientific knowledge, where we have no explanation, we're quite frank about it. We have no explanation. That's why we're working on it. There's a huge difference, I think. 